Hey everybody, how you doing today? Garfield here, Garfield's Gear Review. Today we're taking a look at one of my everyday carry items, which is a knife. Yes, a lock blade knife. This is the Smith & Wesson Tactical Series, the Tactical Tanto Blade. Uh, this is the one I carry every day. It's their Extreme Ops Tanto. Uh, three and a half inch blade. Um, pretty good knife, really. Um, I like it. Yes, the pocket clip here on the side. Good blade, serrated edges, seat belt cutter, and glass break. A few of the things I like about it. Sturdy knife has held up very well. As you can see, there is uh, quite a bit of wear and tear to it. It's been in and out of my pocket a lot. It has been sharpened and used a lot. A lot of different things I've done with it. Um, used a glass break to, yes, break glass, break a variety of glass or plexiglass type things to try and shatter it. Um, the seat belt cutter, yes, it works. Uh, I've used it to cut paracord. Uh, at the moment here, I've got some uh, some thick um, shoelaces, pair of shoes that I bought. These laces are too short, so I uh, I changed out the laces. Comes through, cuts very easily, cuts very quick. Uh, if you use it a lot, do sharpen it. Yes, that will get um, will get dull, just like the blade itself does. Does lock very well. Um, closes easily and of course the pocket clip which I do use a lot it is sits in my pocket all day every day when I'm not having it actually in use um, the blade length 3.25 inches puts it underneath uh, most public buildings which run around four inches some have a little uh, problem with the serrated edges check your local buildings see whether or not it is allowed for them uh, some of them don't like that some do some don't care okay so check your local laws and regulation this one like i said i use it every day i don't put a folder on my kit uh, i usually have gloves out of my kit and sometimes it can be difficult to open um, without gloves this is pretty easy it comes with the little knob there get it open between this and my two sun pry bar, which I've reviewed before. That's my everyday carry. These two things get me in and out of all kinds of trouble. Um, pretty much anything and everything. Uh, if they can't do it, I'm in trouble, or I've got to turn to a multi-tool because I need a set of pliers. So uh, if you need a good knife, decent knife, uh, this won't break the bank for you. It's available in a wide range of places. This is the Smith & Wesson Extreme Ops Tanto. They also make a clip point blade. Uh, I just have to prefer the Tanto blade myself. But works good. Comes with a glass blade. A break again. Uh, the seat belt cutter. Um, mine has serrated edges. You don't have to get serrated edges for the Tanto blade. Or for the, the drop point, clip point blades. You can get them without it. Uh, another thing, even though some people say it's a bit cheap, they do follow some basic rules. It will balance on its own. Some knives I've found recently, um, they come out, they don't balance on their own. They don't stand on their own. They should. It's a simple little thing. They should easily stand on their own when they're put on a flat surface. If I was to get this a little bit better, it would fall off, okay, because my screen is slightly tilted. So uh, this does stand on its own, though. Simple thing, uh, indexes easily in my hand, does, is able to stand uh, as balanced well, stands on its own. Um, they hit the marks well for it. It's not necessarily something you're going to carry into battle, but every day, this is a good knife. So, if you've got any questions, got any comments, leave them below. I'll try and get back to you and answer any questions on that. Meantime, Garfield's Gear Review. This is Garfield. Garfield out.